vlog come back. Okay, so what's happened? Um, 4th of July, that week, I think I made my last video for a while. Uh, I took some time off till, uh, so June 15th, 16th, my grandma died that week. Not, not actually, you know, this year, a couple years ago. Um, and so, uh, I just wanted to take some time to remember her. And then uh, August 16th, uh, was my sister's birthday. So I decided to come back August 20th, um, because I, you know, celebrating the 16th. But the reason I didn't come back the 20th is because, well, this rioting and protesting has really gotten on my nerves. It's annoying because I have to keep hearing it. I'm not a racist. I just, I just don't like, you know, to hear about this kind of stuff. It just makes me mad. And so I just didn't want to talk about that on my channel because I knew I would have to. So I wanted to wait for it to cool down a little bit before I actually, you know, said something about it. So... Um, let's just get into the video. I'm, uh, these are the super yacht life missions or how to unlock the captain uniform. So, um, I did this with my friend Gabe. Now let's get into the recording. All right. So this is overboard. So me and Gabe were just getting ready right here. Uh, so yeah, um, this is overboard. This is like the first mission. It's, it's pretty easy. It's fairly easy if you have two people. Um, so just let you know, this is a kind of a gory video, but this channel's not for kids. I just have to stay family friendly in case a younger audience does end up watching this. So, um, let's take a look at this. So, yeah. Um, so yeah, let's start this. And if you want to know, this isn't live. I'm just like doing commentary. So, um, it's been a while. It feels good to record again. So yeah, this video is going to be a little bit longer. Tomorrow I'm going to do the next two missions, which are the one with the Tula and then the one with the, um, yeah, so the one with like the Tula. Anyways, so uh, I, I'm i going to have to probably uh, like put uh, something over the captions um, because I can't, because the captain swears and I can't put swear words in here. Even though I am a family friendly channel, um, or no, this isn't a family friendly channel, but a younger audience watches it. Um, I still have to blur out those, um, the subtitles. I should have turned those off though. It's the thing is because sometimes, half the time I can't hear what the captain's saying and I wanted to know what he was saying. Um, but yeah, so let's go ahead and, and so yeah, first thing you have to do, you don't want to take the speedboat, you want to take the chopper because it's kind of a long way. Uh, and no, it's not because I'm lazy and I don't feel like flying there. Um, it's because we have to fly to the beach. And so what happened is I went to the Joyriders to go kill them. While Gabe went to the um, yachts and took started taking them out. But I asked Gabe to stop taking them out. Because I wanted to record footage of us taking out the yachts. Um, just so you guys knew that how it, uh, how, you know, you have to take them out. And there's a specific way you have to take them out too. It sounds kind of weird, but there is. So, um, yeah, well, we decided to start, uh, dropping down altitude right here. And so I told Gabe that I was gonna, um that I told, I told Gabe to uh, switch to the seat and, um, what do you call, uh, go over to the port. Uh, so it was right next to the, uh, the port's right next to the joy riders. And so there's three of them. You have to kill them, take the paperwork, get the jet skis. It's really simple. You always want to do this with one other person. You can totally do it solo. I soloed this mission the first time I did it, like the first time I completed it. So you you know you use a sniper right here first guy really easy kill. I'm decent with a sniper so you know. Second guy not so easy so that's why I had to make him crash right here. As you can see he tried turning around or something I don't know. Point is um so yeah he crashed right there, and then I got an easy kill on him and then I got a one star. So let's go ahead and um go over here let's go over here. Let's go get the paperwork. And then the other part that sucks is you actually have to kill the other two joy riders. And I, I really didn't want to. I just felt like getting the paperwork. But even though they were, I had to kill them on land, they were off the jet skis. Um, it was still, it was still like, you know, it was still really dumb in my opinion. Why, why, I didn't know why I had to do that. I just didn't know why. It's kind of dumb in my opinion, having to kill them if they're not on the jet skis, you know. So Rockstar, please take a look at that. Please try and patch that. Thank you very much. All right, so let's see this. Let's head over here. All right, let's take out the um, pistol point fifty, And I think that's the one you use in the diamond heist. Doesn't matter. It's, it's still my favorite, um, it's still my favorite pistol because it does the amount of damage it does per headshot, and then I, I don't use my Mark II suppressed pistol because I only use that whenever I want a stealth mission or don't feel like getting a wanted level right away. 
So this guy, I had to actually jump the gate, which is the dumb part. Um, yeah, my voice cracked. Um, but yeah, I didn't want to actually jump the gate because uh, the cops were on my tail. And yeah, I did have to do some close-up kills with the cops, but um, you, um, what do you call? Uh, yeah, so right here, right? I did have to get headshots. It's kind of gory, but, uh, you know, you know, it's just a game. So, yeah, I had to walk over here and get the last Joyrider, but the cops were coming at me so fast, it sucked, too. Because I had to, I had to run all the way around to these, um, people, right? And I did run all the way to the Joyriders, and these cops, I actually had to take them out before I was even... I could even get this last Joyrider because he had a gun, the Joyrider and the cops. If you could see on my mini map, the cops are creeping up behind me. Um, so, you know, it really, it really was a pain to get those cops. And then, yeah. So, um, there's going to be no audio because, you know, there's swear words, obviously. Uh, and I'm not putting swear words on my channel because I don't want the younger audience to hear this. And then some Karen to report my videos because I really can't stand Karens. They suck. Everyone knows Karen stock. And so, yeah, I here I took the cop car um, to the, um, what do you call it? Because cop cars are actually decently fast, but uh, <laughs> airtime in the cop car, man. So, um, I decided to um, take the cop car over the yachts. And Gabe had already destroyed the yacht that was moving because I wanted Gabe to do that before, you know, uh, it got over to Vespucci and I had to drive all the way over there and blow it up. And so here I told Gabe, Gabe, can you please, um, take out the yacht that's moving? And then Gabe said, I already did. Um, so here's what you have to do. So these yachts, the specific way you have to destroy them is you have to get down, like, on those docks, on the actual docks. And it, I use the Tommy gun here because it, it'll, watch this, watch this. It only takes a couple shots to destroy one of them. And so, yeah, these are actually, like, um, mafia yachts, like, Vietnamese mafia. I think the Triads, um, in GTA, I think it's their yachts. Or, like, no, it was some, um, like, smugglers or so. I don't know whose yachts it was. Jeez, I don't, I don't really care, but the captain said it was the Joyrider's yachts. So, I just automatically assumed that the, um, you know, the first time I did it, I didn't even know it was gangster yachts. I thought it was, um... Yeah, it was from, like, a mafia of sorts or something. I don't know. I don't know. I don't even know who it was. But, yeah, the, for the for the purpose of the game, uh, game, um, because the gangsters were, like, what do you call? Yeah, the gangsters came after us because of those. Uh, they kidnapped the captain in the second mission, which I'm going to, um, do reaction cam to that, too. It's gonna be, like, a second, because... Um, so yeah, you have to just destroy the boats and lose the cops, but I cut it after we destroy all the boats. Um, so I'm just gonna kind of cut that part out, um, where we lose the cops because it's boring. Um, and then I'll, after that, I'll just get to the next clip. So, um, if my commentary is kind of mindless, I'm sorry. But, um, so yeah, what I decided to do is I took one for the boys and one underwater, even though I don't like, uh, one underwater. And then there's water gun of the deep. <laughs> you guys know that meme, right? The panzer of the deep meme. Yeah, so... We're gonna go ahead and get up here. So yeah, there's a jet ski. I don't know if it spawns here every time, but I, I just saw one, so you know, obviously it's freebie. And so my friend Gabe collected my chopper, my um chopper, and landed over at the beach by the airport, which is if you wanna if you have a friend, you definitely want to do that with them. So um let's go over to the so yeah, you need to destroy the last yacht. Like I'm destroying it with the SMG right here. So yeah, there. I, I love how the sails just turn gray and they're not even on fire. I don't know how it sinks without it even being on fire. So, um... Let's just... I'm gonna head on over here. Yeah, and that wasn't a police shopper. That was Gabe's, if you guys couldn't tell. So, yeah, and the reason Gabe's not commentating on this is because I can't record us. Like, people just do a, tr a Twitch stream and then record what they're saying in that Twitch stream. But yeah, so they just record what um they're saying in the um Twitch stream and what their what their friends saying and then they just upload that on YouTube, but I don't stream at all, so you know, uh I just decided to commentate on this. So um yeah. Yeah, so once you do that, you just kinda wanna get in the chopper and then have your friend just like watch this. Look at how fast we lose oh sight of the cops. Watch this. 
like right here. Boom, you see that? We didn't lose our wanted level, but we got out of the side of the cops really fast. And I don't know how, because even if the cops knew what kind of chopper we were in, and we didn't kill the cops in the boat, so they had to radio that in, and, and then they radioed that in. Oh, they're in um the Super Valido chopper, whatever chopper this is, right? So, um... Mm, Alright, yeah, so uh, that's pretty much it for this clip. On to the next one. Alright, so yeah, I know you guys saw the big funny censored sticker. I'm going to put it back on screen right here. Um, because the captain's gonna... I just have to put it over all of his dialogue, because I can't read... It's too small for me to read inside the editor, so... I have to put a censored sticker there, because I don't know when he actually swears, and I can't hear the clip either. Because I have to mute the clip, because he swears, and I don't want to just mute those swear words, because the cops swear too, and a lot, so... Even though, again, I said I don't make videos for kids, my vi videos are aimed at an older audience, so... Like, you know, I don't know, older than 13. Just, you know, people who actually can can accept that they're listening to swear words and watching violence. But even though the GT is not that violent and parents are wrong about it. So just check this out. Alright, so yeah. We, this is over by... I'm sorry, my allergies are really bad right now. So if I'm itching my face a lot, it's because my face does itch. And so let's... Let's head over here. So what you have to do for this one, it's really simple. I mean, if you guys don't like going underwater in GTA, because there's a lot of scary crap down there, just all this one's this is pretty easy. This is pretty easy. You jump, you just jump underwater and grab a couple boxes. There's like a rusty boat down there, and that's pretty much it. I should not be getting notifications on screen by Apple right now. Even if it's like my iPhone settings, I shouldn't be getting notifications on my screen right now. So you just get all 10 boxes, and then um, you you don't even have to return them. You can carry them all at once if you're doing this solo. Um, you can carry as many as you need. So, um, yeah, let's just get this part done. Um, and so, also, um, at a random point in this clip, I'm going to com uh, do what you... I'm going to text on screen what you need to uh, write in the comments to get your comment, uh, comment pinned. Because I can actually check if you're first, and if you're first, I'll pin it. So, you know, I just, I'm just trying to make a good community here. So, let's see this. So, um, so let's go ahead and go ahead and <laughs> let's, let's grab these, um, red boxes down here. Or, yeah, they're red, right? I can't tell. Because they're glowing, so, you know, you can't tell if a glowing box is red or not. All right, so let's go ahead and yeah, let's grab the rest of the boxes. Gabe was really quick at this and got a lot of them. Um, so well, let's just go ahead and do this. Let's let's grab it because Gabe got that one. I told Gabe I was gonna get these two over here because you you could see that one then. So yeah. Also, what do they have fish underwater if they don't have any land animals in this game? I'm I'm just saying. I mean, chops in the game, right? I wish we could actually own pets. Like, go to the Sandy Shores Pet Store and grab some pets. That would be so fun. Like, you know, we could have a dog sitting in our house. And if we move, our dog sits in the car with us. Or, you know, take our dog out to play. That would be so fun. I mean, that would be great. Wait, did I get the second crate? Yeah, I did. Okay, cool. So, um, yeah, even though I can see the um, captions... Even though I can see what the captain's saying, I'm going to still have to put the censored tag over that. Because if I don't, then, you know, in trouble. So, even though I, it's because videos made for kids get their comments turned off. And I'd rather have my comments than make a video for kids. Because I don't, I strictly don't like YouTube. I mean, you know, the way that, you know, the YouTube staff is. But I can't say too much or this video will get taken down because YouTube's like that. So... Let's move on. Um, so, yeah, uh, let's go ahead and just get the jet skis. Because here's the part where you have to kill all the, um, the gangsters or whatever gang it is. You have to kill them all, right? Um, and then you have to, you guys, so if you guys are really bad at shooting, then you want to use a sniper for this next thing. But, um, yeah, you just grab these. There's three jet skis parked on shore. You either take the green, red, or the blue. I chose the red one because, well, you know, it's it's kind of a nice color. <laughs> um, and then the green one looked pretty destroyed, and the blue one just didn't look like a pretty shade of blue. And I don't want to drive an ugly jet ski in my video because I'm very picky about how the way things are. So, um, 
So, you guys, let's just go ahead and save the captain because, you know, I need to move my yacht. Oh, also, also, they um lowered the price of moving your yacht so it's not 25k anymore, it's 10k now. And that's a lot better. So, let's just go over the captain. Uh, and Gabe killed the majority of them because, uh, no, I'm not, and Gabe's not doing all the work. He's just quicker to boats, to the boats than I am. And you actually have to go to my boat, my yacht, and kill all the um, hijackers. But here's what I did. This is funny. Yo, I actually tried throwing myself in here. He just randomly shoots me in, in the head and I would be dead. And then there's Gabe. But, um, so pretty much you have to, um, um, you just have to, yeah, I tried ramming myself into him, but, um, that didn't work so well. Uh, so yeah, um, this is, this is, this is really funny. This is comedy gold right here. I get on it. I get on my speedboat instead of the jet ski. No, I'm kidding. So, um, yeah. So I decided to take the speedboat and be lazy again and let Gabe do everything. No, I'm kidding. Gabe actually got to the majority of the gangsters. Uh, even though I said you know a certain gang name, I don't know if it was them. And um, you know, um. Yeah, I didn't know if it was the triads or not. So well, let's go ahead and go over here. So yeah, if you when you just go to this location, it's really simple. If you guys wonder why I got all quiet, it's because I just need to go to the bathroom. But I'm trying to make I'm trying to finish the recording before I go to the bathroom. So, um, let's, so yeah, you just have to take out a couple of these guys, it's not too hard, my friend Gabe was almost dead here, so, you know, I said to Gabe, um, alright, you know, just, just, uh, take out the guys up on the rock, I'm gonna try and make my way up there, um, I'll save the captain, don't, don't take out the hostages, it's, it's gonna be really quick, and so here we go, here we go. Alright, so there's the captain. I took out the guy behind him, took out the guy behind the bartender, and then just took out the guy in the middle just because I felt like it. And so, then you have to kind of go over here, and then you have to save the captain and the bartender. Now, the bartender, actually, I have to commend her, even though she's an NPC, I have to commend her for this. This is, this is actually really, this is really funny, because there's this boat right here, and I took both these guys out. Actually, well, I took one of them out. <laughs> Gabe, Gabe got the other one with, like, the SMG or something, so let's go ahead and grab this boat. I love how the the boat that looks really ugly is actually the faster boat, so... Why am I getting notifications during recording, you guys? This is so dumb. I'm getting Discord notifications, so everybody, come on. Come on, Gabe, get in. So, yeah, like, if you saw that the bartender actually threw the dead body out and the captain was being a little baby and was, was um, sitting by the rock like a child. If you guys wonder why I'm stretching so much, it's because I'm kind of tired, too, so. Hmm. So, yeah, you just take him back to the boat. This mission's insane. Insanely easy. It's there's no problem with this mission at all. Um But um What do you call? It? Uh it's the only part is t taking out the gangsters on the mountain. You don't want to do that solo. I actually lost a team life the first time I did this. So like on the original campaign I did that and then now I'm doing this, right? Because it's really easy. Um, so it's, it's pretty much the penthouse campaign, and, um, uh, so yeah, um, Gabe's gonna be hosting the penthouse thing, and I'm gonna be doing that after we're done with Super Yacht Life, and so even though there's a glitch with cashing out, I don't do that type of money glitch, I do heist glitches, and the only reason I accept that is because Rockstar took the, um, give money feature out of the game, so yeah, thank you all for watching, I hope you guys have a great day, and peace out.